India are the champions of the world. India has won the ICC T20 World Cup 2024. Uh, uh, and India have reached the pinnacle. Two unbeaten teams who came, uh, two unbeaten teams came into this final and uh, locked horns and uh, were ready to go. And it is ultimately India. The men in blue have done it. India have won the T20I World Cup, the champions of the world. This is the second time India has won the T20 World Cup. The first time it happened, we were the underdogs. India were the underdogs in 2007. A young team that uh, went into that tournament without, uh, without any pressure, without any expectations. They did it once. Now, they, as, uh, as, uh, as a team that everyone, everyone backed, a team that everyone, uh, uh, everyone thought uh, that uh, uh, probably is the strongest team in this particular uh, tournament uh, for some time. India has managed. India has managed to cross the line. A brilliant, brilliant victory for Team India, and you can see that on your screens. The entire country has erupted. People are celebrating on the road. People will be celebrating through the night. India have beaten South Africa in the T20 World Cup final. A brilliant, brilliant victory. A brilliant victory for Rohit Sharma and his men. Uh, there have been uh, a surge of emotions uh, for uh, these cricketers. Hardik Pandya crying his heart out after this victory. There was a lot that was said for Hardik Pandya during uh, the IPL where he did not really perform well. India have won by seven runs. India have yet again created history. Third time in the final, winning it twice. It has been a brilliant, brilliant campaign. India were really in trouble at one point of time. Henrik Klaassen and uh, uh, Quinton de Kock, they were cruising very, uh, they were cruising at a point of time. But at the same time, India kept faith. Bumra kept faith. Rohit Sharma kept faith. And that those two crucial overs by Jaspreet Bumrah. He, he literally turned the game on its head. He first uh, came in and bowled that brilliant 16th uh, over and then uh, closed it out in the, in the 19th over. Uh, it, was, uh, it was a brilliant, brilliant victory. People have been, uh, people are, like I said, are celebrating out on the road. There have been reactions coming in, congratulatory messages coming in. People, let's listen to some of those reactions. And I've also and I've also been joined by Rika at this point. Uh, at this point, uh, Rika, this is this is absolutely historic. But uh, before I come to you, let's li listen to what uh, the fans. Yeah, we are from Delhi. We don't But but we have to come. If we come, if we come, we want to see. After the Champions Trophy, we won the World Cup. After the Champions Trophy, we won the World Cup. After the Champions Trophy, we won the World Cup. After the Champions Trophy, we won the World Cup. last time that India lifted a Cricket World Cup and now after 13 long years India are champions of the world and the champions are back indeed there was a point in the match when Akshar Patel was taken down by Henri Klaassen and he went for over 20 runs in that over um, and the South Africans were cruising at one point they had they they needed 30 runs of 30 balls and in the end it came down to an equation of uh, 16 runs from six balls all courtesy the magic of Jaspreet Bumrah who was brought back by uh, captain Rohit Sharma towards the closing uh, part of the match and Bumrah weaved his magic in fact uh, it was magical Bumrah who laid the foundation of the win tonight. Enrika, what a sensational final, what a sensational comeback by Team India. Uh, people were expecting India to fall in uh, after, after that Henry Klaassen uh, knock, but Unslot, India yes. kept faith. India kept faith, Bumrah kept faith, and uh, Bumrah has been the go-to man for Team India for some time. He delivered in uh, the 2023 ODI World Cup final. We did not manage to cross the line then, but this time around, it has been a fairy tale uh, campaign for Team India. Unbeaten, going on, unbeaten, winning the World Cup. This is for the first time any team has won the World Cup, T20 World Cup without getting beaten. The emotions are absolutely running high. The emotions high. are it's running very, very high. It's not just Hardik Pandya who's crying. Everyone. 
it's everyone who's feeling it. It's uh, it's Rahul Dravid's last match uh, as a coach of the Indian national cricket team. He is crying. Virat Kohli is emotional. Hardik Pandya is and emotional. What, a, what an emotional moment for Virat Kohli as well. He's been a part of India's journey during the 2011 World Cup. We remember those images of him lifting Sachin Tendulkar on his shoulder. Now a senior citizen of the club. It is a tribute to the prowess. It is the tribute to the to the class and mastery of these two men on your screen, Rohit Sharma and Virat Kohli, that India has finally been able to cross the finish line. One also has to speak about Rohit Sharma's captaincy today after uh, Akshay Patel was taken down uh, um, by uh, Henri Klaassen in the uh, 15th over. He went for 24 runs. That was when in the 16th over, Rohit Sharma brought in Jaspreet Bumrah. Bumrah turned around the match and in that, in that, in that over, he conceded four overs. In the following over, uh, he set up that wicket of Henri Klaassen and the moment Henri Klaassen went, the, uh, the, the gates were open and India could get through the South African, run through the South African lower order. South Africans uh, having had a brilliant tournament, being unbeaten uh, so far till the till the final choked in the final moments. Should we say choked here, uh, Osama? Because you know it almost well, it seemed is, that they had them, they had the trophy in their bag. It is a it? little unfair to say that uh, South Africa choked because what I feel is Bumra. He was the turning point of uh, that over. Was the turning point of uh, the entire match. He came in with uh, India with their back against the wall. And Bumrah, like always, delivered in that very over. The, the South Africans, they knew they could not take on Bumrah, uh, they, even if they wanted to. They went through that over, tried, uh, tried to get uh, runs of the next over, lost that wicket of Henry Klaassen, and then when Bumrah came back again to bowl his final over, he was the difference. He made, the, made sure that India had enough to save in the last, uh, last two overs. And that is why he's probably the man of the tournament in for fact, Team India. In fact, in the India. last two overs that Bumrah bowled, he conceded four overs, four runs in one over and two runs in the other over. And that was when South Africa uh, really lost the plot and the equations became tougher and tougher for South Africa. And it is also, you have to give credit uh, where it's due, Virat Kohli, the man of the hour, the, uh, the man that India, uh, India depended on uh, in this particular final, come at the hour, come at the man, Virat Kohli taking the onus upon himself, making sure that he stayed right till the end, got those crucial 76 runs. And uh, when you look at, look at it in the context of the entire match, India were down. India were out of the game in the first six overs, lost mm -hmm. three wickets. Rohit Sharma, who has been brilliant throughout the tournament, he went out early. Then followed Rishabh Pant and Surya Kumar Yadav, two other, two other batters who India have depended a lot in this uh, T20 World Cup. They lost out uh, uh, in this particular uh, match. But then when it mattered the most, King Kohli, he delivered 76 very crucial runs. These runs are worth weight in gold. And uh, India on the back of those, those 70 runs. And then Akshar Patel's 47 runs. Uh, India managed to get 176 on the board. It was always going to be difficult for South Africa when, when they got out to chase. And uh, you could see when Pumra came in, steaming in, in that very first over of his, got that uh, wicket of Riza Hendricks with the, the, with the ball of uh, the tournament, if I must say. And uh, but, uh, uh, from Osama, there on... If you are calling that the ball of the tournament, the, the ball that he bowled to Marco Janssen was a peach of a absolutely, delivery absolutely. towards the end. And that really put the choke on the South Africans. Absolutely. It was Jaspreet Bumrah. We are still waiting to hear who becomes the player of the match. But it was Jaspreet Bumrah in the end, the final two overs that would pay all the hopes of the South African team that lost only by a very, very, very narrow margin of seven runs. 176 for seven. The, the score that was set by India uh, uh, and, and the target of 177 was the highest for any team in T20 World Cup Finals. And so it was uh, anyway a mammoth task for the South Africans to get over that finish line.
how oh when uh, when you talk about that second innings when you talk about that south africa innings uh there are two players that india would have been very very uh, would be very about uh, 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 that is uh, uh, that is uh, um, uh, decock and uh, uh, henrik klassen and uh, both the players they uh, india knew that these two players are the ones who are going to cause trouble who are uh, going to get those runs uh, they they were the, uh, these players have played uh, the indian right. bowlers and, in the ipl and Quinton they Dickock, knew if you if you see he he performed a sheet anchor's role today holding together the south african innings for a very long time he scored a 31 ball 39 for the viewers who are not watching the telecast we have to say that uh, there was a beautiful shot of rohit sharma in warm embrace of hardik pandya in fact he is celebrating the moment the there are uh, there are scenes of celebration all over kensington oval um, rohit sharma is trying to plant an india flag there and uh, the cricketers are doing various other things And uh, to celebrate, we are yet so to see Rahul Dravid. We, we did see him very, Rahul very, Dravid was crying. Very, Indeed, very he was crying. Very, and, very briefly. And the thing, and, and the thing, Rika, is uh, that uh, it, when you look at it in the context of how many tournaments that we have come close and, also and the, lost, you know, it's this is this is a sweet, Dravid. sweet victory for it, not just Rahul Dravid but also Rohit Sharma as the captain.